I'm Jasmine and I'm a first year master's student in athletic training at Iowa State University and I'm going to show you how to use a glucometer. So first we're going to put on our protective gloves and then we will wipe the patient's finger with an alcohol prep pad. Next we're going to check that the, we have loaded a lancet into or a lancet needle into the lancet. This one I've already done for you, so you would push this in here and then twist the protective top off. We'll put the cap back on, and then we'll have it set at about a three or a four, and this is just the needle penetration depth. Next, we will load the stick reader into the glucometer, and then we'll load the lancet. Press down slightly and push. So her glucose level is currently at a 100, which for a random time, it should just be lower than 126. Eight hours after fasting should um, have a normal blood glucose level of 60 to 80. And then um, two to three hours after eating food, which she said she had food about two to three hours ago, um, should be between 120 and 140.